My neighborhood isn't safe anymore. Things are changing. There are intruders invading these borders. I see them setting up shop on every corner. Cafes trying to corner the market, slicing up bread and dishing dough, delivering the morning fix like we wouldn't notice. Well, I'm putting niggas on notice. Starbucks is coming for us. And then macchiatos make me sick. Baristas blow me. Coffee beans grinds my gears because I hear Starbucks is working for the man. And lattes are a part of the redevelopment plan. Cinnamon in the air, daring me to swallow. White lines dividing tar-colored communities till they hollow. Yesterday, I smelled cappuccinos in the air, so business suits are soon to follow. Men writing in loose leaf, drinking loose leaf tea, trying to erase me. No love for the cocoa. Lest it comes from a third world country where they got it for the low low. Organic chai in place of impoverished eyes. The Wi-Fi is free. A small fee while they gentrify your community. Trading in your mug shots for mug shots. But who could be mad at pumpkin spice? The hood is at its boiling point and they just want to put us on ice. The type that will milk a mocha city white and sugarcoat the strife. Steam rolling the streets while steam milk foams on heat and espresso. Soon you'll be black surrounded by white domino or get delivered to a new postal zone like dominoes, they've come to cut off the competition and decaf the legs you standing on. The shorty in the logo looks like white supremacy. Whipped cream on a brown brew is their idea of diversity, which is to say white will always come out on top and people of color forever at the bottom, heated, tell me. Why are communities always dark, dismal, and depleted? Yo, for real, fuck them cups of joe. And them five dollar paninis with their tomato, mozzarella, and pesto. See, there is leverage. There is leverage in the beverages. So beware of the caffeine, because you see a Starbucks pop up, and you know the developers are coming. <laughs>